Hello, it's me James and welcome back to another Minecraft Bedrock Edition bug slash glitch video. So in today's video, I am going to be covering one bug that is potentially really, really dangerous for you. So without actually knowing this information, you could potentially lose some of your precious items or just lose some items in general. And losing items is a big bad. We don't like losing items, right? So I thought I'd quickly make a video on this. And this one right here is about shulker boxes, if you hadn't guessed it already. Again, of course... You all know uh, when you first get a shuckle box, it comes in this color that I am standing on right now. I don't even know what the color of that is, but that's the color it comes in, right? That is the original color that it comes in. You can then go ahead and dye your shuckle boxes to your preferred color. So what happens if you uh, dye a shuckle box a color you don't like? um and you just want to remove it or something like that you can actually wash a shocker box in a cauldron right so if you didn't know what washing is basically you can use a cauldron for a number of different things you can actually use a cauldron to dye armor but you can also use it to wash now let me uh, show you what that means so if we go ahead and grab ourselves some water and a cauldron basically if we go ahead and uh, grab these leather pants right and you can see they are dyed leather pants right they are dyed but we can go like this and we can remove the dye off of the leather pants and of course yeah we can get back the normal leather pants right so we can change the color of the leather pants and stuff like that again if you wanted to change the color of the water to uh, like dye the pants you get an achievement for this by the way um yeah you can just go ahead and do that and you can do that in uh, any color but of course if you wanted to just simply remove the color and get it back to normal you'd uh, wash it but you can also do this with the uh, shocker boxes now uh, as you can see i've got some orange dye in this one and i've got loads of cool items in here right so say like let, let's imagine this one right here is my awesome item we'll get back to that in a second i have got a pink choker box if i go up to a cauldron with some water in it and click it like so it will remove the color and i've got an original colored shocker box okay so if for whatever reason i wanted to change the color or wash my shocker box with all of my items in look what happens it doesn't just wash the color it literally washes all of the items. Again, if you want me to show you this, I'm going to remove this with my hand. Right, so you can see, this is the one with my Elytra and all the things I've been grinding so hard to get. I want to wash the color off of it. And we're going to place it here. And boom, all of the items have been washed away. I mean, seriously, uh... Personally, I think that's a little bit crazy. I think that's a little bit bad. So, um, the thing that I was saying we could use this to our advantage for, I mean, it's not that good, but, like, you know how we always gain loads of rubbish in shulker boxes? So, for example, I don't know, we just had a bunch of sticks. Um, I'm always making tons and tons of crafting tables and stuff like this. I don't know why, I just do it by accident. You know, just stuff like we don't need anymore. Dirt, I mean farm blocks, not that I have any farm blocks. It'd be cool to get one of those blocks, though. I don't know if you can get them in survival. Hmm, that's a good question. We'll have to have a look. We're going to get all of this. Just, you know, just junk, like, that you accumulate and don't want. Uh, for example, loads of seeds. Like, sometimes I get shocker boxes of seeds. I don't know why. You just do. You just accumulate junk. It's just how Minecraft is, right? So, we're just going to get all of this to uh, stand in for us for some junk, right? We got rotten flesh. You always get so much rotten flesh. You never use it. I mean, yeah, you can feed it to your dogs. But, what? I mean, it's, it's not that great. It's just not that great. Um, so, yeah, we got a load of junk here, right? We're going to put all of this junk inside of this shulker box, right? And what I thought we could do is simply use this. It's kind of like an in-game clear command. So it's like a in like a survival clear command. You know how you can do the clear command? It clears your inventory. And then, uh, yeah, I mean, I suppose, kind of not your inventory, but a shocker box clear command, if that makes sense. Oh, God, I'm going to have to break this with a hand again. So we've got the junk box. And if we just go to the, uh, the cauldron full of water... We wash it. Of course, it does need to be in a uh, colored shocker box already. So we will need to go ahead and dye this. But we can uh, go and grab some dye around here. And you don't even need to get a crafting table. You can just dye them in your inventory like that. And now we've got the shocker box. Wait, let me do that again. Because we've got another one. We've got to do it to that one. As you can see, we're going to wash it and get rid of those items. I mean, kind of handy, kind of not. I mean, like I said, if you've got a shocker box that you just can't be bothered to empty just wash it i mean that's the only thing uh, i could think of that this is a positive for 
But for the most part, I just wanted you guys to know this just in case for, for whatever reason. I mean, it's something that I would do by accident and lose all of my items. So yeah, there we go. I will catch you on the next one.